Day weekends attract visitors to our sunny Central Coast beaches, but with more people comes more trash. KSBY reporter Megan Healy is live in the studio. She went to Avila Beach to see how much trash was left behind. Megan, what'd you find? Well, Richard, after walking up and down the beach today, I didn't see that much trash left behind in the port. San Luis Harbor Patrol said today it looked better than most days, but still some people left more in the sand than just their footprints. People flock to the beach to enjoy the day off. Ramsey Cooks was one of the many beachgoers and says he saw a pile of beer cans left in the sand. He and his family tried to help, but couldn't carry it all to the trash. I have three able-bodied boys that, you know, would pick up what we see, but yeah, there's still too much. He was shocked that someone could litter like that. The boys love coming here. We, they grew up here. We play football here in the community, and it's just, I don't know, it's just disheartening. Harbor Officer 3 Kyle Schaefer says leftover trash is usually a problem during summer and holiday weekends. It's definitely an issue, um, you know, with a lot of recreation and, you know, people having lunch down there and having a beach day, stuff gets left behind. He says it didn't look as bad today. Right now the beach is, is looking pretty good. But everyone has to do their part. One woman walking the beach says she didn't see much trash at all. No, we didn't really see anything. I mean, there's a lot of people, which again is the usual crowd for the holiday weekend, but not a lot of trash. Whether you're visiting for a vacation or a staycation, Harbor Patrol reminds people to pick up after themselves. Just bringing down a trash bag and, and encouraging everyone in the group to, uh, to pick up and even the small things, the small plastics that can go ocean bound, um, and uh, contribute to the big picture. Harbor Patrol also wants to remind people not to feed wildlife or leave trash for them to eat. Live in the studio, Megan Healy, KSBY News. Megan, thank you. There will be a beach cleanup day tomorrow at 8 a.m. in Avila, and of course, all volunteers are welcome.